All right, that's going, so that's good. Mm. Back over here. I can't wait until I have my little adapter so I can have all three screens going. All right, well, how's everybody doing? Good. I'm here, so that's oh, I'm an still achievement. Muted. I'm good. Still not here. <laughs> you, you take that back. Oh, I was talking to stuff, not you, beautiful. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh. That's going. We'll deal with that in a few minutes. Do, 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 do. Where are we? D20. Is that right? D20. Yes. D20. Do, 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 yes, and we know. Three minutes and we'll get started. Cool beans. Oh, it's a cat. There it is. Anybody want to bring me up, up, up to speed as to what I missed last week? In uh, three minutes? Well, um, the big thing is, is you guys started exploring the dungeon that is under... Uh, the bathhouse. The bathhouse? Yeah. The bathhouse in Baldur's Gate. You were here for that, weren't you? No. Oh, okay. Apparently a lot happened last week. Well, I think that was two weeks ago, wasn't it? Yeah, you went you yeah, went to the bathhouse with us. The soaking stone? The Mormon bathhouse? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so, um... You guys began the exploration under that. Uh, you you guys are basically searching for uh, evidence of the cults, or the cultists that are in or that are down here, and what's going on. If you can resolve the the issue down here with the cultists, um, you can uh, bring information back to, or you can bring that back to. Uh, the sergeant that you guys met in the beginning and say, hey, we did it. And then that's, we're going to go from there. Yeah, and we saved one dude from the... Oh, that's right. Yeah, you did. Yeah. yeah. Or we drew a map for him and <laughs> told him to go on his way. He drew a map and said, get the fuck on. <laughs> Here you go. Have fun. One minute. I love that song. <laughs> you change your mind like a psycho bitch, but the sex is good, so I think I'll keep you around. Uh, I've been there. I've been there. Oh, that 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 was the wrong version of the song. I'm sorry. Oh no! You were singing the Katy Perry song. I was there. Oh wait. Yeah, Just kidding. <laughs> pretty pretty accurate. I think we've all kind of uh, we've all kind of been there. 
<laughs> as the crazy yeah, one or as the person all been that's the, doing the crazy? Yeah, yeah that's mm. what I was going to say. <laughs> I know my place in this answer. <laughs> Same. Uh, okay, all right. Cool deal. Let's go ahead and close that. Hey, all right, cool. Uh, did we take, did anybody take notes? Do we have notes for last week that we can go over before we get started? We do have notes. Uh, who would like uh, inspiration? Uh, well, I guess who wants to read them and then who wants inspiration for taking more notes? Don't everybody jump at once. I'll read them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I'm just going to read the notes that were post posted in the Facebook chat. Okay. Um, Zanny killed a female torturer while Lila knocks down the male torturer. The group helps Clem Jasso and loots the bodies of the two attack attackers, finding a key ring and a shield with a skull painted on it. Clem informs the group about the house Jasso, owing them a favor. Zara commands three skeletons to rise and follow her after saying, Rise and be counted, and picking up a skull. The group explores a room that smells dangerous and triggers an event where Lila throws a match and Ur gets knocked unconscious but is revived by Lila casting Spare the Dying. The group discovers a long hallway with multiple doors and finds a coffin with a mummy that holds a magic bag of beans. The group decides to take a long rest while the skeleton squad is on guard duty. Alright. Let me finish moving arranging a couple of items on my screen here. Cool. Uh, and um, I guess I I'll take this. rearrange <laughs> something of mine. Hey, oh. Hey. <laughs> this, I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, all right. So you guys did take a you guys did take a short rest, uh, or excuse me, a long rest. Uh, inside the crypt room here with um, Zara's zombies guarding the door. My bag of beans. Yep, and you have your bag In of my beans. my pocket. <laughs> and my wife. My wife. Uh, okay. Well, with that being said, uh, what would you guys like to do? Did anything happen during the... Um time we were taking a long rest um no because i was a bad dm and didn't write anything so here we are oh uh, you're fine. Strad, so we don't have dreams like yeah we don't, we don't okay. have dreams of the, of the big big bad or anything. you haven't made it into hell yet which that that becomes a thing when you once you make it into hell oh my god i'm gonna say what's okay. this yet bullshit yeah <laughs> it's coming don't don't you don't you worry your pretty little face do not get complacent. Okay. Where am right. I? Uh, well, where are you? You are... Right there. <laughs> this is our wonderful bard. Yeah, I didn't... I hadn't been dragging... We, we didn't drag you along. Your your character came along, but your icon didn't. So you, you pretty much... You, you were there for everything, but you didn't... Uh, you didn't accomplish anything or not. Accomplish you watched. Anything. You didn't participate, yeah, though. You're very, very <laughs> doesn't sound like me. <laughs> Can uh, Okay. So, yeah. Um, yeah you, you, uh, you take uh, seven or eight hours of a, of a rest. Everyone was able to actually get a reasonable amount of rest. Uh, simply because you had... The zombies were outside standing guard, so you didn't have to uh, trade any... You know, having any, you know, any stand watch or anything. Okay. All right, so um, I'm going to take a look outside where the zombies are. All right. Three, four, five, six. Okay, so everybody. Okay. Uh, yeah, you go ahead and make a perception check. Okay. And we'll. We'll go ahead and get things. Get things rolling. <laughs> get things rolling. Uh, 
Um, you. The door to your due east. Uh, you hear um. You hear some moaning, like um. Oh no, of, moaning in the soaking stone. Yeah, not, it was not, but not that kind of moaning. More of uh, I'm in pain kind of moaning. <laughs> Um, oh no, someone's doing it wrong. I mean, I mean, it could be. I mean, I don't, I don't know what you're into. Uh, but apparently, yeah. But uh, you also hear some scratching, uh, some scratching noises coming from this door right here. Okay, um, I'm going to tell everybody that uh, I hear someone that might be in pain in this door to the far east of the hall and I'm going to go check it out. Did you not learn anything from last time about mm -hmm. checking things out? I'm a barbarian. <sighs> okay. I'm a barbarian. <laughs> no. Oh, was that in character? I'm so sorry. We have. I, I answered that as myself, not in character. I'm sorry. I mean, I feel like it's. it's I, I think you're a barbarian. Okay. I'm the barbarian. No. Um, mm -hmm. Well, what if somebody down here is hurt? I mean, I need to go check them out and see if they're okay. That's in character. I mean, I get that, but just be careful. Zara, maybe you should. I'll do my best. Seems dangerous. Uh, okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, so you have approached the door. Are you gonna? How are you opening the door, or do you intend to open the door? Um. Yeah, I'll open the door. Um, I guess somewhat stealthily, I'll open the door. Uh, give me a stealth check. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, you can open the door. You will. You will get the. You will be able to see anything in here before it sees you. Uh, the walls of this room are covered with streaks and splashes of dried blood. Two dangling bodies are shackled to the east and south walls. Uh, one is an elderly, hum uh, elderly male human, the other a young female tiefling. Both are covered in bloody gashes and neither is moving. In the middle of the room is a sturdy wooden chair with a bloody whip draped over it. A bucket half filled with salt sits in the floor nearby. Pleasant. Oh, that's awful. Okay. Well, I go to the the elderly person. Is no. that the one at the top? Uh, the like this? No, the elderly one is at the is at the bottom. He's at the south. Okay. Um, I'm. Can I use a medicine check to see like? If they're con if they're unconscious but alive, I mean, you said that they were yeah. just sort of in yeah, there. Yeah, sure, go ahead. Okay. Uh, you are able to discern that this individual um has died, uh, fairly okay. fairly recently, maybe within the last twelve to maybe sixteen hours. Uh. It, <laughs> I'm sorry. While we were sleeping. Pretty much. Yeah. Um Okay. Yeah, and you can even see that it appears uh that he's probably bled out due to the extremely deep gashes that were uh appeared to have been opened by the by the whip. Okay. Um, I'm going to call back. Um, Lila, do you say anything for people who recently died, or do you do anything? I don't know if she can mm. hear me. I can hear you. Okay. I, I peeked my head out. Um, this is unfortunate. Um, I walk into the room as soon as I can find myself. Boop, 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 boop. Which one is it? The one on the bottom? Yeah, the one on the bottom. Uh, okay. I am so sorry for you, you poor soul. You did not deserve this. I light an incense and 
I say a prayer to let them find peace in the afterlife, as this was not the way that they were meant to go. Okay, and um, can I also check to see if this person is still alive? Uh, yeah, go ahead. You can certainly try. <laughs> oh, why did it do that? Uh, yeah, you, um, as you're kind of inspecting the individual, uh, she begins to kind of, you know, kind of groan, and she's semi-conscious at best, and she's mm -hmm. groaning in agony. And while you're considering this, I need to reset my uh, roll 20. So one second. Oh, wait. No, it fixed itself. Okay. Ah, cool. Never mind. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, she she, she kind of moans uh, in her in her sleep or in her like, semi-conscious state. Um, you said, is she shackled like the guy that we rescued? Yes. Yeah, she's shackled... Okay you know, up over her head, like, uh, you know, think classic dungeon shackles. You shackle right. up in the air. Okay. Um, can I, <laughs> can, um, can I use my mall to try to free her? Like I did the other guy. Uh, yeah. Uh, make an attack. Okay. Uh, yeah, you're able to, you strike uh, the, the center of the shackles, and the shackles kind of separate, uh, and she falls to the ground. Um, she, she lands fairly hard with a, you know, with a, with a grunt, uh, but she's still, she's still pretty out of it. Okay. Um... Can I use a medicine, can I use, like, a medicine check to like get her standing or is that not how you do use that uh i mean you could um okay yeah you can like i guess to... stable yeah. sort of. but just but keep in mind like i said she's still like mostly unconscious so okay you, know, you could you could stand her up but you'd kind of have to weekend at bernie's or <laughs> okay smelling salts here you go <laughs> well no. i mean yeah, that's, yeah i don't know okay i'll i'll try uh, no. Yeah, your your efforts to to kind of get her up and moving um, are are pretty unsuccessful. Um, Lila, can you see? It. Yeah. <laughs> it seems like you're having a bit of a struggle there. Let me see if I can do something to help. Oh, that's not much better. Uh, I, I can help. Uh, yeah, Wayne, go ahead. Yeah, why don't you come over and take a take a whack at it? There you go. That'll work. Oh well, that works as well. Yeah, that that'll that'll work. Uh, go ahead and roll a d8. And what is your spell casting ability modifier? That would be on your spell on the spell page. It would say like wisdom or I think it's charisma, and then whatever that mod whatever your charisma modifier is. Oh, charisma modifier is a four. Okay. Uh, Everybody loves me. Gotcha. All right. So you 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 give this individual uh, four hit po or eight hit points, which is actually more than what she needs. Um, your roll alone uh, brings her back to uh, lucidity. She's she's still a little on the weak side, but she's she's now conscious and awake, and she's you know kind of starting to pull herself back together. Uh, and it, she's like, oh, wh wh where am I? Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> well, you're in the, um, the soaking house. Um, deep in a dungeon. Underneath oh. the bathhouse. Uh, I, I'm not sure... I don't know. Last I was out on the streets, I don't. You know, she's absolutely just com completely confused as to as to what's going on. Um, is there any other way out of here? Is it just just that the doorway we came in? 
to oh in, to in, this room. oh to this room oh I'm sorry yes there is there I guess I should have been revealed if you dang god damn it uh, there is a door to the north I'm sorry I should have I should have cleared that um do you think that maybe we should just get them get her out of here Lila? Um, I, I, I don't know what to do, because I feel like if we sent her on her way, she could be in danger just as much as the other person. But also, we've got more to do here. What, what do you think we should do? She, well, she could come with us, but we'd have to protect her in the process. I, uh, kind of walk up to you close enough that I don't think you can hear me. Mm -hmm. Do you want to worry about protecting her the whole time? Or do you think we should just send her? We don't even know anything about her that we don't know her name. Anything. This could be very well a trap. Hey lady, what's your name? <laughs> uh, she responds she replies um <laughs> She's a spy. Uh, uh, <laughs> Not a spy. She she, she replies, uh, mm. Vinda, Vinda Cress. Okay. What is your well, name? Do Vinda? Yeah. Uh, we are uh, wine merchants in the lower city. Hmm. There's not really much of a correlation between her and the other guy. This is so weird. Do you remember who brought you down here? What they looked like or anything? I I remember seeing. I remember being on the streets and 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 I was confronted by these dark figures and I I don't I don't really remember anything else. What do you think? Should we just send her on our way then? Um, were they asking you questions earlier before you lost consciousness, or were they? Do you remember? I, I, I everything's a little fuzzy, but but I think I think I was asked about the family's security operations. I, I think that's what it was. It was something to do with our family's our family's security of of protecting our wine interests. Okay. Um, do you know this guy beside you? Uh, yeah, she looks over and, and she sees, that, you know, he's bloodied and all fucked up. Uh, and she, no, no, I don't, I don't know who he is. Hmm, okay. I want to search the, the guy that's here to see if there's anything on him that might help us figure out who he is. Okay. Uh, investigation check. Uh, you're, so. um, you're rifling through his pockets and whatnot, and you, and you, you do find what appears to be maybe a, a, a change per, purse or something with, um, some papers in it, um, and you see on, you're not really sure what type of papers are in there folded up in here, but you do see the name, um, uh, Elfinax Zelbor. Oh, this one's got a creative name. He's also a tiefling. I don't know if we. Oh. Yeah, I don't know if we. Okay. I think I. Yes. That, yes. Yeah. He's a tiefling. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can I tell anything else about him? Like just based off of that investigation, like, does it look like he came from wealth? Does it look like he's a worker? What? What? Can I tell anything? Um. You notice that he has very rough hands. Okay. Uh, well, I'm really not too sure what to do. Uh, this guy looks like he might have been some sort of worker or something based off the way his hands look. I don't really yeah. see a connection between the two or with the other guy, though. I'm not... Uh, this is very bizarre to me. 
Vinda, would you come with us? Um. Well, I don't really have much of a choice. I don't think I really want to stay here. Okay, we can try to take we can try to take you with us then, but you have to make sure that you stay out of the way. If we absolutely. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. I, I, I can I can definitely do that. Okay. If that's cool with everybody else, then maybe yeah. we can ask Zara if um, she will let the skeletons have another command added, and see if they can kind of like if she gets if Vinda gets put in danger, one skeleton will try to intervene um, to kind of be like a bodyguard for her. What do you think? Oreo, is that cool? Are you are you there, Oreo? Yeah, did you Eddie? mute out? Did did you die? He didn't say anything when he came into the party. Oh. What command? There oh, we go. There you oh, go. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's like, did you die? <laughs> you yeah, that was key, worse than the fucking a waiting keyword for, uh... or something. I mean, yeah, they, they, I mean, they'll completely you know, They, um, I think we went over this, but yeah, they're they're completely under your verbal command, so they they will listen to you. Um, I kind of I kind of see them as the um, you know, the 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 mummy guards at the in the in the mummy movie that were. That, yeah, that are that you have to have the book to command, but they just completely, you know, with with unquestioning unquestioningly follow commands. That that's kind of the way I see the uh, I see the zombies here, the uh, skeletons here in this instance. So you can literally give them any command that you want, and they're they're going to listen. You want me to just tell them to watch over her. What do you want me to tell them? I mean, just you could just have one of them um, kind of be like a bodyguard for her, maybe, if she's put in danger that one of them will defend her. Mm. I was going to mark one of them, but I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, here, I can mark them if you want. Watch this. Yeah, I can too. Let's see. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you can. I always forget that you. Everybody else has access to those icons. Uh, I got a better idea. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, give her one of my long swords. Vinda, have you ever used a weapon before? Well, not not particularly, but I mean, I understand that you know, pointy in goes in other person. <laughs> That's exactly you correct. Me of a little warrior I used to know. <laughs> the warrior that I used to know. Uh, but she went and then she cut me up. Oh wait, just kidding. Wait. Yeah. Uh, held that one with the bodyguard symbol. He's gonna keep an eye on her. Okay, that'll work. <laughs> okay. He's buff. He's swole. I'm down. I'm He's a swole zombie. <laughs> So she'll have a sword and a bodyguard. All right, so she now has a sword. And I think she just rec she just uh, what's this? Is it one one d six plus strength? Is that correct? Or uh, one d eight. One d eight. Two hundred. One d ten. Okay. Okay, we can we can make that work. Um. Okay. Cool. Uh, as a matter of fact, you know what? Let's do this. Let me pull her up. Uh, let me give her uh, her own character sheet. Because that will be the easiest thing for me to do. Duplicate. I don't know if that does it. Copy of commoner. That'll work. Uh, Oh, shit. Oh, 
second. Sorry, guys. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. He's not cooperating. Give me 30 seconds. Bear me. There she is. We'll put her at the bottom in here. Close that. Close that. That'll make it that'll make my job easier if I do it this way. Uh, edit. So you know, her name is how does it spell? Do 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 Vendra Cress. And then she, Cress, okay. Yes, K R E S S. All players journal. Save mm -hmm. changes to that. And come on. There she is. And in her particular instance, it says club. We're going to change it to. Sword. Long sword. One, and we're just going to give her, give it as a D8 because I'm not going to let her swing it two handed because she's not going to have the strength for it. So then. One damage. Okay. <laughs> Oh golly! All right, well, that sounds about right. I mean, that that's fitting. Yeah. Uh, okay, so yeah, she is, she is up and going, and she is. Uh, let's see, she's ready to go. Okay, there we go. All right, where are we going? What we would like to do from here? Okay. Um, do you guys want to? keep going this way or do you want to I heard some scratches like down here earlier mm. so which way do we get I don't know because there uh, could that could very well be a, an army of those fucking rats or whatever that woman had earlier it could be can I make a perception check next to the door you sure can you sure can try <laughs> <laughs> warms my heart um well yeah, it's you, a door yeah it's it's a door and um <laughs> there there is some sounds coming from behind the door uh what those sounds are you are um not overly sure as to what they are guys i found something <laughs> i'll try i'll help uh, okay, so um, Lila, you you uh, approach the door and kind of lean in to inspect the door, and you kind of hear some shambling footsteps, kind of like meaty footsteps, kind of plopping around. Are they? What's it sound like? Uh, well, like I said, it, it's it's got that like uh, like that meaty, uh, yeah. shambling, you know, just right. Kind of... so, it's zombie, probably. Yeah, I think it's a zombie. I realized I was muted because I was. Oh, okay. I was just. Which... <laughs> but I was like, oh, I think it's a zombie. <laughs> you want to go meet the zombie? Not particularly. Not until we figure out what the other door might have. Okay. He doesn't, Let's he doesn't go. know we're here, Let's... you know. Yeah, you have a point. Okay. Let's go the other ah. Let's go the other door yeah. then. Last time you didn't listen to me, you almost died, so you know. Ugh, I might be lording that over your head for a minute, I'm sorry. Hmm. Okay, let's investigate this door then. Um, perception. Yeah. Mm, 
Mm -hmm. I'll remind you. Oh. <laughs> well, uh, you perceive that it's a door. Um, it's a door. It would probably be better um, maybe to investigate rather than per perceive in this instance. Mm -hmm. That's so, not much better. It's really not, but I, I will say this. Um, it doesn't appear that you can hear anything beyond this door at the moment. I can't hear shit. <laughs> I can't hear shit. In the cadence of, we ain't full shit. <laughs> I'll throw an investigation in, too. Yeah, oh god. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Did you, though? We're just I'm gonna kick, kick, kick. walk out here. Hey, Guys, I found a window. there's a door. <laughs> I would really like someone to come and investigate it with us. Um, preferably someone that might be able to do better than a 12. Team. <laughs> Yay, Wayne! Uh, What's better than a 12? Yeah, uh, you, like, you still don't appear to eat nothing... You, it doesn't appear to be having any uh, sounds. You don't really hear anything coming from behind these, uh, from behind this door. <laughs> you, you don't really appear to hear anything coming from behind this door. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna rage. Open it. Wait, wait, what? Well, I'm waiting. I'm just. I'm getting raged here. I'm enraged. No. No, no. <laughs> We're getting pissed. Stealth. <laughs> Stealth. 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 Thing. Fucking fairies getting angry Hammer. at the door. <laughs> All right, door. let me try to stealthily open Fucking this. Door. I would like to just peek in oh, and see what go. I see. All right, you're gonna peek in and see what you see. As I'm peeking, I'm giving the fairy a piece of like sugared fruit. Calm down. You open the door. And stop you. You see the, the <laughs> corridor. Um, uh, goes to the north and then bends to the east, and you can see what appears to be uh, steps that uh, that are starting to work their way down, um, and continuing on. Well, it looks like we need to walk through this door because I can't see anything beyond a small room and going into some steps. Okay. And what do you you, you want to do it? Yeah. Do you want to fly in first, fairy? Yep, I'm flying in. That way, the, the ground Would you doesn't say the get stairs touched. descend. The stairs do descend. Yes. I'm gonna fly. I'm gonna fly down right. and see what I can see. Uh, you, just, you come down the steps and you see that the hallway makes another bend uh, to the south. Okay, I keep following it, right. still flying, not touching the floor. <laughs> So, uh, as you come around the bend, I think there's flavor text for this, isn't there? No, there's no flavor text. Uh, you see a man dressed in a red robe. He sees you, his eyes gets wide, and he turns and begins to sprint to the east. Oh. Well, he got yeeted out. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna book it after him. Hey, you! At this point, I'm following because uh, I can hear a shuffle. Yeah, I was gonna yell that I, uh, you guys ran off with the group. Uh, okay. So as you come around the corner, you see, you see him running and making an attempt to turn to uh, the south. And he's still, he's still. Why does he look like Norman Reedus wearing a red uh, ball gown or something? It's red robes, <laughs> but yeah, fair point. It's the Spanish Inquisition. Nobody expects them. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna stop here, and I'm gonna wait for the rest of my people if they want to follow me. Um, because you know, either either way, I'm I'm gonna come over here and. I guess, do I see where he went? Just to the south? Yeah, you see, you see, yeah, you see him disappear around the corner. Okay. <laughs> oh, Smokey. <laughs> you went into a weird pit. Uh, th yeah. You're going to fly weird pits. <laughs> uh, mm. 
it seems like. Okay. Um, well, I am going to go this way and see if I can see where he is. And one second here. Let me make some changes. So as you you know, you wait, you kind of you hesitate just enough for the group to catch up. Uh, and as as you hesitate, you hear a door open and slam shut. Um, you, you find this hallway here. Oh, my God. I hate this thing sometimes. Um, you, you, you're now in this, this hallway where you have a door to the north, uh, northeast, uh, which is right here. Uh, you have a door to the uh, southeast, which is right here. And then you also have a door to the due south. You heard him go to the south, but you do not mm -hmm. know which of the two doors to the south uh, he went through. Okay. Um, I want to go to the door directly south, and I want to listen. Is that investigation? Uh, or... yeah, give me perception. Perception. Okay. Uh, you do not hear anything through this door. Okay. Can I open it stealthily? Give me a stealthily roll. We are stealthily. That's not stealthy. Uh, as you open the door, you do hear uh, a little bit of squeaking, as the you know the door is not the most um, smooth on its hinges, uh, revealing uh, four flickering torches in wall sconces illuminate this crypt, the middle of which is occupied by an open stone sarcophagus. The sarcophagus bears no carvings or other ornamentation, but is full of humanoid skulls and bones. Uh, six dusty bedrolls lie on the floor around this. Okay. First. But, um, I found some, I found a bunch of bones, guys. Oh. Yeah, and it looks like people were sleeping around the bones. I would like to... Hmm. I'd like to do an arcana check, uh, I guess, and see if I can feel any magiciness. Uh, you definitely oh. don't feel any magiciness. Mm. Mm. I barely feel my own two feet. Uh, that's, that's accurate. Um. Let me, um... <laughs> what what did we used to say? Let me uh let me uh aim. <laughs> <laughs> you want to aim for a blue die? Is that what is that what you're telling? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah let me try again. Yeah, oh yeah, John does sound pretty far away now. Uh, well, that's also because I moved away from it. Oh. Um. I did not knew. Let's see. Yeah. Um. You do not. You didn't. You do not sense any magic. Uh, or anything of that nature uh, from, uh, from inside the um, sarcophagi. Uh, can I investigate it? You sure may. If there's any, like, trap door buttons. Yeah, help yourself. Oil can. Trap door. find um you do not find any trap doors well all right i'm going to just go ahead and do i guess a investigation and just mess around in the bones i want to see if there's any Anything in there that's not bones that may be like hidden? 
See if there's any like weapons or anything. Uh, yeah. Do you? How how are you? How are you doing this? Um, I am taking the base of my. I guess just using my mace and kind of like, like kind of like a a shovel. Just kind of like feeling around because I imagine some of these bones might be sharp, broken. I'm not really trying to get hurt myself. I'm just trying to see what happens, what I find with that. Okay. Yeah. So you do some you do some scribbling, scrabbling around, and moving stuff, mm-hmm. shuffling around. Um, you you see that there's bones in here of various ages. Uh, some appear to be pretty. Um, some appear to be pretty old, some more uh, more recent, uh, but it appears to be just nothing much more than human and humanoid bones. Hmm. Well, guys, I really don't know what's going on with this. Um, not sure if there's a, a reason for us to stay in here for too long, though. What do you think we should do? Mm-hmm. Um, we could try the other door for that guy. Okay, let's go. I guess. Okay. Um, I'd like to, um, I guess perception, or I'd like to listen to this door here that I'm at. Uh, okay. Perception, I guess. Yeah. Oh. Maybe not. Uh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> certainly a door. It's it's certainly a door. That's about uh, all you're able to discern at this exact moment in time. I'll do the same thing. Okay, that's a little bit better. Uh, yeah. Uh, Steph, you hear from behind the door, uh, some some whispering. And you're able you're able to make out uh, the phrase um, uh, "stay quiet." They're coming, guys. They know that we're here. All right. So can I bash him? No. 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 We need to check that other door first before we run in. We do. Yes, because maybe it connects. Oh, God. I'm getting <laughs> nervous. <laughs> okay. uh, I make a perception check next to the other door. Uh, ooh, okay. Yeah, the one that doesn't suck. The one that doesn't suck. Uh... Hey, that's good. Um... You hear, yeah, 17, yeah, you hear, um, you hear footsteps moving around inside this room, and you also hear, um, some, some dripping. Dripping. Can I tell if it's like, does it seem like hurried footsteps, or? No. I thought you were going to ask about the dripping. Is it thick? Is it thin? (laughs) <laughs> is it moist though? How mo- <laughs> I mean, it's dripping, so take it as you will. But yeah, no, yeah. you um, no, it doesn't appear that you hear um. It, it, yeah, the footsteps don't appear to be hurried. But I I will okay. tell you that it, you do only hear one set of footsteps. Um, okay, so they're around. probably not connected. Okay. So. Is it smashing time? I suppose if that's the way we must do this. We must. Trust me, we must. Oh. Everything is smashed with you. Exactly. Now you're getting it. Okay. So, can I, like... Okay, is the door unlocked? Did we perceive that? <laughs> <laughs> you, haven't, that all... yeah, you, haven't, you haven't checked that. We didn't touch okay. the door, no. We just put our <laughs> Guys, face against I, I it and listened. What is it? I was going to say, I, I have an idea. Okay. Sure I mean, this hallway, we could close the door to our uh, our west, open the door to the top, and then we could run into, like, the crypt and close that door and maybe see if 
whatever's in the top room. Assuming it's hostile. Uh, goes and visits our friends to the west. East, I mean. I know I was right. Wait. To the right. <laughs> so, open try, try the door. Get, if uh, the people here are hostile, we could try to get them to maybe yeah, fight each other, potentially. Is what I'm doing. Really oh, really so maybe we could, uh... Maybe we could, like, open the one door and, like, throw a rock kind of thing, make them both come into the middle. Mm hmm I mean, there's potential for it to, like, be worse if they're friendly towards each other, too. That's the only thing, is right now we have the advantage that only one of these rooms know that we're here. And if they're friends, I mean, I imagine if anyone's just walking about, they probably know each other. Um, because everyone else that we've encountered, um, look at it, you, Vinda, has been maimed. So, I think we should maybe just open one door at a time. This might cause more trouble if we don't. Um, you only heard one person in the northern door, right? Mm -hmm. uh, there, I would start with one. Okay. Yeah, we could go figure out who they are or what they're doing first, and then... Mm -hmm. And then let's we say let's do that. Someone knock and Before ask somebody them. starts to smash in. You're so negative. I'm just careful, okay? Negative. You almost died. I know, I was there. Yeah, I know too. I was <laughs> doing CPR on your chest to stay alive. I appreciate that, and I will pay you. I don't Some... want to be paid. When I, I get just money. want you to not die. <laughs> Working on it. Okay. Let's do the thing. With the plan. Alright, All right, so what are we doing? Uh, we are going to open this door where Zanny is. Okay. Because I don't know Zanny's character's name. Who's doing it? How are oh. we doing it? Uh, I... <laughs> I'll make a stealth roll. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Okay. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> why, why do you sound surprised? <laughs> Relief. Relief. <laughs> Not surprised. Relief. Uh, let's see. Do this. I want to shift ping so I can move my map. Yeah, shit ping. Shit ping after some shit pinging. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Uh, after some shit oh. pinging. <laughs> uh, God damn it! Go back to the other thing. All right. Um. Yeah. You you slyly open the door. And... You made me think of Charlie Brown. You sly dog. Why, you. Why is it? Why is she in the GM overlay? She's not supposed to be in the GM overlay. Oh, there's a she. Uh, uh. So, um, kind of huddled in the back of the room. Uh, is a very elderly looking female. Uh, she has been beaten, battered, bruised, and is absolutely covered in blood. Oh, God. I'm going to walk in and immediately, you know, kind of show her that I mean no harm. Are, are you okay? Are, are you alive? Hello? Uh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, she she sits up in her eyes and she she cowers back. Please, please don't hurt me. No, no, no sh I've already. Sh it's okay. I'm not here to hurt you. Shh, it's okay. It's okay. What's wrong? What happened? They 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 told me that they were going to they were going to add my blood to that. And she points at the the sarcophagus. And at this is the point where you notice that the sarcophagus is filled almost to the oh. brim with um, with blood that's beginning to coagulate. Hey. I could smell it as I walked in. Have you have you already have they already put your blood in there? Or that's probably gonna be like they're gonna kill you is what they mean. No, they just Okay. I said, they, <laughs> I'll go back, sorry. Uh, they they have just been asking questions. Are you okay? First off, I'm gonna come over to her. 
Um, and I guess assess like where she is as far as health goes. Um, how's she looking? Nice check. Um, <laughs> she seems um, she seems pretty well off considering the amount of the amount of physical damage that she's taken. Um, okay. Hey, thanks, mystery. Yeah, so she's yeah she's she seems she seems okay. Um, she seems more psychologically hurt than she is you know physically you know you know physically hurt I guess. Guys, what should we do? I don't think she could go with us, but she needs to get out of here. I. I I feel like psychologically, we can't put her through anymore. If she follows behind with us, she's going to lose her mind. She's going to lose her sanity. I mean, we could take her back up or she could stay here while we deal with whatever the other guys. Do we want to check that room first and then decide what to do? I would love to check that room. <laughs> Yes. Okay. Um, what's your name, ma'am? Uh, uh, Nibra. Nibra, I am so sorry you've gone through so much. Um, I offer to say a prayer with her to uh, calm her soul and bring some lightness to her. Okay. Uh, I mean, I don't really know if I'd do anything for that. There you go. Have a religion. Oh, I'm very good at praying. <laughs> Yeah, uh, your your words seem to to put her a little at ease. I can't promise you that this isn't going to be a difficult journey, but if you stay here, we can at least check and make sure the next step of it won't be as difficult as whatever you've gone through in here has been. But for now, just just stay in here. I promise you, we will come back. Uh, oh, oh, okay, yeah. Um, or is it time to get smashing? Yes, ma'am. All right, okay. well. I smash. smash, exactly. We're going to open this door and we are going to smash people. Are you going if to the door is if, if the door is unlocked. <laughs> if oh, not, yeah. Just <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Hey, can you unlock this? Right. I, I really like to run this over. Uh, I just want to talk. <laughs> Yeah, so how how are we doing this? I am going to bust down the door and I'm going to rush whoever is on the other side in a rage. You're going to rush in a rage. Uh, yes, I am. Okay. You me click my rage cuz I can do that. Um I or do it. Yeah, let's see here. I got to <laughs> Let's see how I'm going to do this. Uh, be right back With back. your hands, Bert. Uh, um, stop. Yeah. Okay. Um. Sure. So you um, you shove the door open and you begin charging into the room. Uh, let me reveal the area. You charge into the room, rounding the corner. You slam your body into one of uh, the individuals that was uh, in this room. I need you to. Oh my God! Uh, make Norman read us. Uh, make an unarmed attack. We see. We just an yeah, unarmed. Yeah, just you're just coming in. Or I mean, if you have a club in your hand, you can oh. use that too. Yeah, I have a mall. because yeah, so, that's yeah, what I. Sure, go ahead. Swing. You, you go the in mall. and you, you swing the mall. All right. Cool. Yeah. Come on, here. Yeah. There we go. Ha. Hama. There you go. Get messed yeah. up. <laughs> so you come barreling in, rageful, swinging your maul down, catching uh, the first guy right square in the chest. Uh, in the jaw. Come on. Oh, <laughs> I guess it helps if I click the right button. Allegedly. Allegedly. There we go. Uh, 
Puts down seven. Uh, all right. Well, everybody's favorite phrase. Check oh. yourself before you wreck yourself. Yeah. Roll <laughs> initiative and be sure you click yourself before you wreck yourself. 10.13. Uh, let's see. Yes. Do, 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 do. As soon as my character sheet wants to load. 13. Oh, wait, do I have to click my picture first? Yeah, oh. you click your icon mm -hmm. first, yeah. I clicked, I clicked my name. Hold on. That's not me. Okay, one minute wow. is 10 game turns, right? Yeah. I did not do very uh, well. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, six, it's six seconds. Okay. Yeah, six seconds a game around, so yeah. Okay, I was just making sure so that I could calculate stuff. Or the rage length. The length of rage. Yep. It's a long one minute. Time. One minute, you're getting messed up. Smoky Oreo. Wait, I already Smokey. did. You butt. I didn't see. <laughs> I'm sorry. You better be. Damn. Everybody rolled up. Are we good? Believe. I believe so. Um... Okay, cool. Oh, these guys are fun. All right, let's see here. We've got to do this, and then we got to do descending. Zanny gets the first turn. Okay. Oh boy. Don't fuck and it up. You would be so kind as to no, tell I me your hit points. Oh, right. Uh, uh, I'm at, oh, at five. You have, Thank you. You have five hit points? Right. We uh, just had a long rest, too. So. Yeah, you, you. Sh yeah, you should go back up to yeah. you. You should be at full health. Regular. He's like, what are you talking about? <laughs> that is full. Uh -huh. So sad. I never ate my vegetables. No um, eating the vegetables. Is right here standable? Uh, sure. I am pretty small, so you could yeah, probably yeah, you stand can, yeah, right You can occupy the same space as her. Stand on them. Excuse me, pardon me. Don't stand uh, on them. Stand on them and see many, what they How many hit points do you now have? Uh, 15. 15. That sounds more like full. All right. What would you like to do? You're up. I'm going to take a swing at that dude. All right. Swing away. He liked to swing a... I take Beth my great and sword Juna and, and spring make a great attack. Uh, unfortunately, your great attack was not so great. Uh, <laughs> it... It cleans bum, bum, bum. off. It, it appears Bam. to be that this uh, this individual is wearing some type of armor underneath the robe. Mm. It's cheating. I couldn't see it. <laughs> Open your eyes. Uh, <laughs> so you probably only have one attack. Is that correct? Uh, yes. All right. Scribbles, how many hit points do you have? I have 16. 16. Oh, it's Mrs. Nesbitt tonight. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> You're up. Um, I'm I'm super on, far Mrs. away Elizabeth. from here. Um, so get to walking. You get to walking. I'm walking here. All right, there we go. I move up to there and <laughs> end my turn. <laughs> All right. Oh boy. What a time. Let's see. What a time to be alive. Uh, let's see. It's a little old goblin lady. I guess his next band. Let's see. You know what? He's gonna take since he can't he can't get past the one it's this one here. It's his turn. He can't get past the one in front of him. 
So he is mm. going to attempt to use his longbow to fire at Zanny. But oh. because he is um, well, with, uh, well within a... Uh, he's too close to fire it properly. He will be firing this shot at disadvantage. Mm. Oh, boy. Watch out, Er. Might come for you. Nope. Uh, he, 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 yeah, he, he misses all the way around, so we're good there. Uh, so that will be he shot it into his the turn. Uh, mm -hmm. It is now this creature, or this guy's turn. He is going to swing. He has a club, too, right? He has a mace. Uh, he's going to swing his mace at you, Nicole. Uh, the... These guys have advantage in melee combat. So he's going to swing okay. his mace with advantage. Ooh. Oh, shit. Uh, um, I do have resistance to bludgeoning. Is have, that bludgeoning? Yeah, you have resistance? Okay. Um, yeah, because I'm in a... Ooh. Cool. Okay. Cool. Uh, oh, boy. You, so you take six damage, but you're resistant, so you only take three. Three. Okay. So that is cool. his turn. Uh, Mr. Wayne, how many hit points do you have? Fourteen. Fourteen. Oh. Hi there. How did you do yeah, so uh, you know, Whoever's up front, if they can't get around, then that's me hitting him, right? Uh, yeah. Well, wait a minute. Where where were you? I was back here, but I, I, that's because I wasn't paying attention. I was moving along with you guys. I just didn't move my character. Okay. All right. Because I couldn't see me because before there were two of me there's the one you did and i couldn't move it so i did mine oh okay yeah. uh all right so I, can, you... I can be out here if you want no, no, you, that's perfectly in. fine. No, no worries you and how many you, you had how many hit points 14 14 14 all right well do your thing sure. oh good uh, yeah, you come swinging in with your long sword, and it glances off, uh, the armor. Um, Damn. Nicole, I, did you set it, you set that at 17, didn't you? Yeah, because that's my current. Okay. Um, yeah. I'm not used to um, people taking initiative. It just gets me every time. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I'm going to, um, I, wait. I can fly, I can't. Okay, let's not do anything really crazy. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to. I'm going to continue welling on this guy with my maw. Okay. Whale away. Yeah. Come well away. Come well away. Anyone doing Get nine right. damage? Yeah, mm -hmm. you hit him and he takes it full on in the chest and it almost knocks the wind out of him, leaving him with six hit points. <laughs> Uh, all right, so that is his turn. Uh, I get advantage on each strength check we weapon, so okay. while well, I'm in rage. Gotcha, so. gotcha. Uh, let's see, there's three of you up front, so we're okay. going to roll a d6. One, two, three, four, five, six. This, is going, this attack is going to go against Mr. Wayne. This, uh, this guy in the back is going to draw his longsword and fire at it. You with disadvantage. Longbow? Yeah, his longbow. I'm sorry. Okay. Ooh, <laughs> no, you're fine. Everybody's just... favorite. You know what? We're, oh, we're, boy. We're in such close, cramped quarters. He is going to strike uh, the one that you've been wailing on, Nicole. He's going to strike him in the back, uh, piercing through oh. uh, the kidney of the armor, uh, doing four damage, reducing him to six hit points. Or, yeah, two hit points. Six to two hit points. There we go. Uh, that will be his turn. Uh, Nicole. I'm sorry, uh, Steph. How many hit points do you have? 17. 17. It is, mm -hmm. it is your go. You are blocked by Wayne at this point and Zanny. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Because I have spells. And spells do not require any of that. I'm going to... Let's see. Oh, oh, golly, no. Oh, the cats just got the zoomies now. Prepare for noises. Let's see. Oh, yes, yes, yes. There's plenty of room. Perfect, perfect. 
All right, so on this one in the corner, I'm going to cast, if I can get it to show up, uh, Sacred Flame. Sacred Flame. All right. Uh, Flame-like radiance descends on a creature that you can see within range. The target must make a dexterity saving throw or take 1d8 radiant damage. Which creature are you targeting? This one in the back. Him in the back. All right, so that's him there. He needs to make a deck save of 15. Yes. Come on. One deck save coming up. Uh, he succeeds. Bullshit. Uh, and they also have advantage on uh, saving throws while in combat, too. Not that it That's matters. right. Oh, yeah. They were like that with the other one. So he's got 22. Well, uh, I've, I've done all I can do. Oreo, how many hit points do you have? I think 13. All right. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> uh, what would you like to do? Who's the one with one HP? Uh, that's not one HP. That is his initiative. Oh. There you go. <laughs> oh, what does this first guy have? Uh, the first guy, he's two. one. He has two hit, two hit points. Oh. Hmm. Think yeah, he's the only one I can reach though. Technically, because I have to walk forward down and over. Mm. All right, I guess I will come in here. Okay. And rapier him. All right. Barely knew him. Maybe. Uh, thirteen. Nope. Yeah, it glances off his armor. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I will. Okay. Take my leave and <laughs> go back out Very right nice. here. Very uh, nice. Let's see. Back into safety. So he can see the three of you for sure. So, uh, it is this gentleman in the back. It is his turn. He is going to use his longbow at disadvantage, and he's going to take a shot at one, two, Wayne again. Oh. Uh, let's see. Oh. And it's disadvantage, so he fires. Oh, rolling a one. Uh, let's see. Who's Damn. So he's going to hit this one right in front of him, right? Yep. Hitting him for three hit points, putting him at 19. Um, yeah, they'll just slap the shit out of each other. Yeah, you know, they'll say, you guys, they're doing more damage to each other than you guys are doing. Um, yeah, he's going to take us, he's going to attempt to stab at Zanny, uh, this particular gentleman here. Or not take a stab, so he'll be using his mace. Swinging with advantage. Uh, I don't think an 11 hits you, does it? Uh, no, uh, nope. Armor class 13. Gotcha. So he's swing and a miss. Um, it is uh, it is uh, Vendra's turn. She is going to um, stand in the back and do nothing. Very good. Good job, Vinda. Thank you. Yeah, that's... Vendra. That's where she needs to be. Uh, yep. All right, Zanny, you're up again. All right. Uh, will I be at any disadvantage from this guy if I attack this guy? Uh, no. Okay. Uh, I'm going to swing my uh, great sword for a great attack. Uh, at, at, at that guy. Gotcha. Uh, an eight does not do it. Uh, scribbles. This could do it, so can you? <laughs> all the way, all the way in the back. 
15, 20, 30. All right, I moved there and I still can't get anyone, so I'm going to stay here. How you guys doing? You want you want some water or a snack or anything? Some yeah, a snack. <laughs> oh yeah, some Gatorade. It's like the mom for Mean Girls. Uh, let's see. This one, <laughs> this one down here is um, going to make an attack, and he's going to try to fifty-fifty against either Wayne or Nicole. Uh, Wayne, would you like to be odds or evens? Uh, odds. You are odds. And they're just, oh, they're and just that bound and determined to wail on you. Uh, he's going. They don't to, like the cut of your jug, man. Yeah, pretty much. Mm -hmm. He's going to swing his mace at advantage. Uh, Seventeen. I'm sure that hits you, and that does eight bludgeoning damage. So six. Is that right? Mm -hmm. That is his turn. Uh, the, this guy is going to make his attack back on Nicole. He's going to swing his mace with advantage, swinging hard. Ooh. Uh, eight, eight, nine, you're resistant. So that's four and a half rounded down. You take four damage. Four damage? Okay. Uh,. Wayne. Okay. It is. So I'll swing back at whoever's closest. Uh, yeah, uh, the closest one is going to be the 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 one that just attacked Nicole. He has two hit points. Smack him. Uh, a thirteen glances off the armor. Oh. Uh... And Nicole. Yeah. Okay, well, I am going to um, smack at the one that's been smacking at me with my maul. And it's smack got advantage. Smack, smack. Smack. Sugar smack. No. Oh. Ooh. Maybe. Ooh. <laughs> I mean, yeah. right about now. Your, your, your nine is advantage, so you got that going for you. Uh, let's see. One, two, three. He's going to fire his longbow at somebody. And that somebody happens to be Zanny. He's going to fire at Zanny with disadvantage. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Which one is it? Is it him? Thanks guys. Keep uh, doing it. Let's see. We're going to we're going to 1 2 3 it and see who see, see who he hits. 1 2 3 4 5 6 one, two, three, four, doing four damage. So the arrow whizzes out, catching the the front man in the back of the head, uh, piercing all the way through his uh, eye socket and um, doing him in. Oh, my God. God, so bad. Scott, uh, you just helped me up. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, surely I can't roll that many ones. Yeah, yeah I can. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Uh, Steph, you're up. All right. I can actually do things. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and move myself in just as to not risk shooting anyone or slapping anyone around with okay. the mace. Uh, I'm going to aim at this fellow right here in front of me and let's see i'm going to use my damn glancing off some armor and now i'm here in the way uh mr oreo you're up all 22 but one guy uh yeah thought they hit each other more all right no well, they did they kept hitting the same guy he's 19 all right i guess i'll he's not dead. uh 
He's a splat on the ground. Yeah, there's no way. All right, I guess I'll just go up on the first guy. The guy that's 19 and rapier. One rapier coming up. Or not. We're not. Y'all rolling like shit. Uh, Jay, right. go, bro. Mm, I'll go back here. All right. Let's see. Yeah, the twenty-two is up, and he's going. He's got Steph, Nicole, and Zanny to shoot at, and he's going to shoot Steph, Nicole, Zanny. One, two. So shoot at Steph, but it will be at disadvantage. Mm. One disadvantage. Longbow shot coming up. Uh, nine. Doesn't, <laughs> doesn't do shit. Try harder. Uh, let's see. <laughs> this one is going to target one of the three of the same individuals with his mace, which he will have advantage on. He's going to target one, two, Steph. All right. I brought this upon the myself, mace. didn't I? Eighteen. I see it. Mm. Ugh, that hurt. Uh, I take eight bludgeoning damage. Mm. That's me at nine. Okay. Yeah, all one. <clears throat> nine. All right. Uh, Vendra is still going to hang out in the back and um, not do anything. Uh, Zanny. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna s <laughs> another great attack. All right, go for it. If I keep repeating the joke, eventually uh, my attack will land. Oh well, it looks like you're really not on me. Oh. Yeah, your repetition worked. Uh, you. Which one did you attack? Oh. Uh, Hopefully not me. Gotcha. All right. Uh, <laughs> five damage I'll do my against best. him. That's the 19 guy, I think. Yeah. So that puts him down to 14 hit points. Ooh. And scribbles. Scribble! She's on her way to help you guys. <laughs> <laughs> scribbles is awesome. Almost there. Hi, Zara. That's it. All right, and that's it. Uh, okay. Well, uh, he's directly in line with, with Steph. So this one is going to swing on Steph <sighs> with advantage. Swing in the mace. Big mm -hmm. dick in it. 16. Oh, that hits. I am at zero. Ooh, you go down to death saves. <sighs> Fuck. Let's see. Uh, Wayne, you're up. All right, is it this one that's doing all the damage or this one? Uh, they're about 50-50. But I will say the one to the... No, this one here uh, is the lowest on hit points. If that makes any difference in your mathematics. Sure does. Because the dude smells like worms. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so he needs to make a wisdom saving throw. He does have advantage on saving throws. Uh, wisdom saving throw against 14. He rolls an 18. Just glances off of my bill. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, then that is, oh, that's, a, that's your action. All right. Okay. Uh, let's see. All right, Nicole, you're up. <clears throat> okay. Um, I would like to. Can I fly like to here? Like. I'm sorry. Mark it again. Can I fly like, here? Uh, you can, but you will suffer two attacks of opportunity. 
Cool. Okay, then I'm not gonna do that. Um, okay, can I, um, can I go up, like, next to, um, her, and can I use a medicine check to stabilize her? Yes, you may. I would have to get out of my rage first, though, right? That's like a free action, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, you would have to, you would end your rage for sure. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna end my rage and do that then. Okay. Uh, Alright, yeah. medicine. Yeah. Thirteen. Uh, sure. Yeah, you can stabilize her with a thirteen. That brings her to that brings her back up to one hit point. <laughs> <laughs> what uh, happened? Smelling salt. Isn't it great? Let's see. He's it's in the stinky. Back. Uh, all right. So homeboy in the back here is going to uh use his longbow, and he is going to target. Uh, well, he's got three options again, so we're going to do it. One, two is Steph. Three, four is Nicole. Why well, he's going to shoot at, shoot at Steph. Oh. Yep, he's going to shoot at you again. But it's disadvantaged. <laughs> there you go. Okay. He rolls a four. <coughs> I'm on the ground and you couldn't even hit me, you suck. <laughs> don't just say don't challenge him. <laughs> I do what I want. Whatever, whatever, I do uh, what I want. Speaking of uh, doing what you want, what do you want to do now? It's your turn. Good God. Um, I have a potion of healing that I bought okay. with my stuff before this adventure started. So I'm going to drink that right fucking now. All right, you have, you have two choices. Um, Okay. I, I don't know if you were here for the house rule on this, but the, I've changed the rule a little bit on potions. Um, okay. You have two options. Option number one, uh, you can take the potion as a full action, and you don't have to roll for it. You get the full ten hit points. But that's your turn. Mm. Or you can take it as a bonus action, and you uh, will need to roll the uh, the two d the two d four plus two. And then you'll still get your regular action if you wanted to do something else. I think I'm going to take it as a bonus action just so I can uh, try to wallop on one of these peoples. All right, roll for it. So 2d4 plus 2? Uh, yes. Whoa. I'll take it. Uh, so yeah, so you'll get 5 hit points. Whoa. Hush. Just, just chill. Plus... Uh, oh yeah, plus what? Uh, plus two. So you go up to eight. I thought you were telling me to chill. I was like, nope. what? Nope. I was talking to the dog. I was telling the dog to chill. <laughs> it's like, damn, John. I didn't even. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. All right. I'm up. Uh, right here. This guy in front of me. I am shooting a crossbow. Uh, which one you're shooting? Well, it doesn't matter. It, it it doesn't hit. Bitch. Uh, it it pinks off their uh, off their armor. Pink. Uh, Oreo, you're up. I know. I'm just gonna walk. You just hold your hold your panties. Mm. Right. Yeah, I got P too. So, do the skeletons get their own turn, or do uh, I? My command is my turn. Uh, it's a bonus action to. And they will. Uh, it's a bonus action, and it'll be on your turn. Hmm. Okay. Well, I will go try and rapier this guy. Same guy again. Fuck him up. Rapier him in the bow. Uh, you guys are rolling like shit. It's roll twenty. I'm telling you. We didn't hear the dice color. With it. Yeah, I was gonna say change the dice color. Change dice. Uh, let's see. Homeboy in the back here is gonna draw another. Or, or, or did you want to do anything else, Oreo? I guess I shouldn't have cut you off. No. Okay. That's it. He's gonna fire. If I stabbed him, maybe, but. Gotcha. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay. So who is he shooting at? He's gonna shoot at Nicole. Okay, disadvantaged longbow. Uh, I 
out of nope. 11. All nope. right. And then homeboy here is going to swing his mace, and he's going to big dick it at <laughs> Steph. <laughs> well, if he's got to do it, I guess he's doing it in such a way. Uh, Fuck off. 12. I'm right in front of you, and you still missed. Uh, Vendra is going to hang out in the back and cheer you guys on. Sandy, you're up. Uh, well, it worked last time. So swing into that dude. All right. Uh, and... Uh... Uh, 17 does not hit. Well, damn. Yeah, they're armor class 18. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is redonkulous. Uh, scribbles. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, and we're just gonna stab her. Uh, before you complete that entire move. Oh, yeah. Oh. You got to... Uh, well, I'm going to let this attack stand, but I'm also going to tell you that um, if you cross into this room, you're going to have to suffer two attacks of opportunity. Okay, i seen that. I didn't notice that. I'll take it. <laughs> take I'll it. take it. All right. Yeah. Typically, they're taken at disadvantage, but they have advantage, so these two attacks are taken at regular. Uh, Hi, yeah. So the first attack... Uh, fuck... <laughs> Who does he hit? Uh, he's going to hit the guy next to him, or he's going to hit the guy down here. Uh, yeah, shoot each other. Damage. God damn. Uh, <laughs> 17, and then the one that just got hit, he's going to take his attack against you. Hey, that makes more sense. Uh, oh, that's God. Gonna hurt. You take 15 oh. damage. Oh, oh no. Scribbles, no. scribbles. Oh, he puts you on one hit point. Uh, Gosh. Hey, you're not dead. That's all I need. But, um... <laughs> <laughs> who, uh... Who, who, who are you hitting? Um, we'll go with this one. Scribbles comes out of nowhere. Yeah, and just... Comes out of nowhere, <laughs> do five damage. So, it puts, you, it puts him at twelve hit points. Uh, and then, oh wait, nope, it's okay. <laughs> you try to run back out again and run the gauntlet again. <laughs> run the gauntlet. <laughs> yeah, let's go. I'll survive it this time. He leaps in and just gets somebody. Just baseball swings it with the mace and just takes <laughs> him out. Uh, let's see. This guy is going to attack, and he now has three options. Uh, one of them is Mr. Smokey, and he'll be the one too. He will be and the it's gonna one go to Nicole. damage you. Okay. So <laughs> he gets advantage with his mace. Wolf. 22, doing 8 damage. 8. Now that hurts a little bit. Wait, doesn't she take um, half damage? No, no she's not. No, because I'm no longer enraged. Oh, shit. Yep. I had to get enraged to help you out. Mmm. I All right, appreciate Wayne, you. No problem. Which one's got the lowest? At this moment in time. This one, right? uh, yeah, he has 14 hit points, yeah. That. There you go. Oh, yeah. 21 hits, you do 7 damage on the 14, reducing him down to 7 hit points. And you'll need to step in a little bit closer. It's going to put you in range and, of attack. And and his shoes smell funny. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, All right, uh, Nicole, you're up. Okay, um, I'm going to switch weapons to my great club. Okay. And I'm going to attack this guy. All right. Fifteen. Fifteen doesn't do it. Part. Okay. Um. Can I? Well, I can't really do much of anything else. Okay. Uh. Let's see. All right. 
this guy, a little, you know, seeing a little goblin just arrive at his feet. Uh, Alston. Yep, he's going to swing <laughs> his mace at you with advantage. Oh. Uh, 23 doing six bludgeoning damage. Uh, scribbles get splattered all over the wall. Um, which one was that? This one back here. Okay. Because you didn't roll for my shoe smell, funny. Uh, you didn't roll your wisdom check. Uh, vicious mockery is a um, as an action, so you can either swing your longsword or use the um, vicious mockery. I thought I had two actions per round. I didn't move. No, you, it, moving moving doesn't res, it doesn't count as an action. It's a separate. It's a whole separate thing. A bonus action and an action. Yep. Uh, I mean, unless you want to change. I mean, I, I mean, I know you don't want to change it, but I mean, if you do, um, we can. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Steph, you're up. <sighs> okay. What's this guy at? Seven. And this one? Uh, um, twelve. He's at twelve. Okay. Um, I guess I'll go with the one on seven. I'm going to... Oh, I don't want to do a check because that's just not what I want to do. Shoot him. Damn it. Uh, yeah. Well, shooting him at this range would have been at disadvantage anyway, so. Oh. Uh, that doesn't make me feel much better, well, but no, it's a I'm little. Just, just trying. Uh, or should be <laughs> up. Oreo, are you muted? Oh, I thought you said Smokey. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what? Nope. Get... All right. Hey, so you, uh, Cookie two, Man. Seven. This one's four. Oh, that's it. All right, I will try and swing on this guy again with my rapier. Oh. Hey, you hit him. 18. Hey. Uh, you're hitting the one with seven hit points. Is that correct? Hit him for a lot. Yeah. Oh, five. Puts him at two hit points. Good. And all right. I'm assuming you're going to back back out. Or you're going to. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I'll stay there for this turn. Uh, can I call the skeletons and all of them move, or only yeah. one of them? No, you can call all of them. Okay, so I believe they have thirty. Yeah, they have 30, uh, 30 feet of movement. Bring them out. Bring them out. Well, they won't make it all the way, but... Close enough. Okay, that's all it. Get in the zombies as well. Uh, let's see. That means there's four of you now. That, you know, three, yeah. One, two... One, two, three. Okay, there's four of you. All right, so he is going to use his longbow at disadvantage. Uh, this is going to go against the Zanny. About time. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Disadvantaged. An eight. Oh, um, yes, uh, homeboy here with two hit points 
has all four of you to swing at, so he's going to choose. Uh, he, too, is going to hit at the Zanny. Mm. Starting to feel singled out here. Uh, unfortunately, this is advantage, too. Uh oh. Uh, 18. Oh. Uh, uh, it hits. That definitely hits. Uh, down to 10, I believe. Uh, you are correct. You are down to 10. Uh, oh, you're doing see. better than some of us. Uh, Vendra, she's going <laughs> to move forward because. You know, she doesn't want to be left by herself, but that's going to be all she does. Uh, Zany, you're up. All righty. I'm going to look this guy square in the eyes. All right. Try my best to take his life. Okay. Yeah. That rhymed, kind of. <laughs> Get it. Nice. Get wow. It. Got it good. <laughs> Describe his death. Uh, he was holding a mace, right? That is correct. Uh, yeah. That is incorrect. I sliced <laughs> his arm off, and then I run him through. <laughs> All right. Oh, nice. <laughs> Ooh, blood just went everywhere. Uh, yep. yeah. Yeah. It was such a it was such a violent dismemberment as the as the um the the Thanks. arm with the mace um, falls to the ground. His fingers are still moving. Oh, uh, nice. <laughs> uh, question. Yes. Uh, how do I send a thing in the chat again? Like a, oh, there it goes. Uh, would that allow me to take like a step here, and then make an intimidation check against uh, that guy? Yeah, I don't know. Let's take a look. Oh, do you want me to like get the actual info instead of just the name? Yeah. Uh, there we go. Sorry about that. During second level, you can push yourself beyond your normal limits for a moment. On your turn, you can take one additional action. Once you use this feature, you must finish a short rest before you can. Uh, sure. Yeah, you... Um, yeah. Uh, you didn't move, so you would still get your movement action. Right now, you're still your movement part of your turn. So you step forward. You still have an action to spend. Um... You could attack him if you wanted to. I mean, you can intimidate, but I'm just saying you could also, you could also attack if you want because that's a sec a whole full second action. Uh, I could. Um, I think my character might do this. Okay. Uh, par uh, partially because I just watched him fail miserably several times in a row. Okay. Uh, make a intimidation check. All right. Uh, I uh. I guess point the great sword at him and say, "Drop it before you hurt yourself or someone else." <laughs> nice. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? You absolutely do. Uh, he, it scares the piss out of him, and he drops the sword, throws his hands up, and waves the flag. There we go. Dido starts playing. Yeah. Um, He's, <laughs> his 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 uh, his attacks will uh, his attacks will or his turns will be spent cowering in the back. Mm, okay. Nice. That that's that's wonderful. I love it. Okay. Uh. All right. Well, we're gonna go from a you know, amazingly good situation to not so good <laughs> situation. Uh, mm. Scribbles, would you mind making a death save? Oh God. <laughs> Oh. That is a success. Yeah. One and oh. All right. As soon as I can get to you, friend, I'll bring you back. Uh, so, homeboy here is going to swing his mace at one of the four of you. A two. This is going to go against Oreo. And this is no, thank you. <laughs> and this is advantaged. Ow, my knee hurts. Ah. Uh fourteen. No thank you. Thirteen. Uh you take five damage. Mm, no. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no lemon. Punch. No, no. Thank you. I refuse. <laughs> 
Uh, Wayne, you're up. Okay. Let's have Sonya on the weapon. Sonya, no. Uh, let's. Well, he's that one's dead. Um, you have we got that one that's with would be within range. Which one? Uh, the one to the south here. Okay, oh, so I don't know. Fuck me. I won't do it. Uh, Nicole. Yeah. You're up. Um, I am going to uh, attack this guy. All right, go for it. Uh, with my great club. One great club coming up. Yep. Comes with bacon. <laughs> Ten doesn't do it. Okay. Mm. Uh, does right. a sixteen do it? Uh, no, a sixteen does not do it either. Their armor class okay. eighteen. Uh, oh gosh. Okay. He's going to step forward unperturbed by that intimidation check. He is going to make an attack on Zanny. Uh oh. And it is advantaged. Uh, twenty-three. No. Doing seven bludgeoning damage, dropping you to three hit points. And that is his turn. Steph, you're up. All right. Man, we we really need to not come into rooms ever again. (laughs) This is painful. No more rooms ever. (laughs) Nope. Just always. Always. (laughs) <laughs> All right, this guy. Speaking, a lot of people die in rooms. <laughs> yeah, uh, the guy in between me and Scribbles okay. looks like he needs a smacking. Uh, he he, he um, can take a smacking. He has. I'm gonna try to give him a. Oh, he has God, twelve it. smacks uh, left. Uh, do you have anything to give you advantage? Um, I have. Advantage on all wisdom saving throws. Okay, well, I was and trying. resistance to psychic damage. I was trying. No, yeah, like I have spells and things that, but I, I can't. I don't uh, think I'm able to do any of that with mm-mm. the no. things. Oreo. Oh. 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 Twelve. All right, can I swing on the guy with twelve right here? Yes, you may. Uh, I believe I believe it's that one. Yeah, it is. Ah, your guys' dice suck. Which I can't say anything. Mine suck too because the number of ones I've rolled. At least be thankful y'all haven't been rolling ones and hitting each other. Um, is gosh, they're all coming in here. Okay. Um, let's see here. Oh, they're all in here, aren't they? Uh, okay, yeah, fuck it, go for it. Yeah, call them in. Okay. Can they attack on the same? Sure, probably not. Yeah, you, you absolutely can. You know? Yeah. You can you, basically what you could do is you could point at one of the the dudes and be like attack that person, and you they would move and attack. Yeah, unga bunga. Uh, I point at the guy that I just missed. Okay. Now they're all gonna. They, I mean, unless unless you say otherwise, they they are all going to attack him. So. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, roll three zombie attacks. I think you you have access to their character sheet, right? I don't know. I think you do. I think you do. Where is it? Uh, Skeleton. There it is. Uh, armor class, hit points, weapon, short sword. Uh, 17 does not hit. It's not showing up. Oh, uh, is it not showing? Uh, a twenty does. Well, it's not for me. I don't know about uh, yeah. Uh, Oreo, go into the settings of that character sheet uh, on the cog and go to never whisper rolls. 
Uh, always whisper rolls. There you go. Mm-hmm. Uh, all right, so... 20 hits. A 20 does hit, dropping him down. 7 to, damage. Yep, 7 damage puts him at 5 hit points. And then the other one swings and doesn't hit. And doesn't hit. Okay. And let's see. That's your turn. So the fist that is in the back here, he's still cowering in the back. And given the fact that the skeleton's just rolled up on him, he's he's not in the best of conditions right now. Uh, Vendra is going to move up here so she's not alone. And Zanny, you are up. Oh, I'm swinging at this guy. All right. And he has. Is he full up? Yeah, he's full up. Uh, 23 hits. Uh, eight damage, putting him at 14? Yeah, 14. Someone waited until 11 o'clock at night to use a grinder. (laughs) What? (laughs) The whole neighborhood sounds like a fucking grinder. Uh, That's messed up. I am that guy every 5.30 a.m. (laughs) <laughs> oh wait! <laughs> oh, that was good. Oh, that was, yeah, well played. I didn't even get it. Uh, all right. Well, oh. on that note, uh, Scribbles, can you make a death save? Oh God. Ooh, you're one and one. <laughs> He's got so many to to swing at. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So a D eight and re-rolling eights. All right. One, two, three, four. Okay. This is gonna go against Oreo. No, thank you. He didn't ask <laughs> first. Uh, no consent given. Oh! <laughs> oh, God. Oh. oh. You might not need it. Uh, 11 hit points, or 11 damage. <laughs> uh, that one might hurt a little bit. Oh, that puts you on death saves. Oh, God. Okay, which... Okay, that was the one with the five. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Wayne, you're up. What's the point? Alright. Oh. Alright, Eeyore. Okay, Depresso. Let's go! Uh, Play us a tune. Oh, you're wait, slashing? that's gonna roll. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> it's just damage, it's gonna roll. Wait, you can do that? <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, yeah, no. That's that's doesn't hit. That's also yeah. not really a roll. <laughs> it, it, that's what I'm saying, it doesn't matter. These dice fucking suck. They've sucked the whole last three times. I have I've hit one thing yeah. out of every roll I've done. So sometimes they it's great. Sometimes they just suck. And when they suck, they yeah. suck for every one. Still so um, waiting on great. It hasn't been great since we started. <laughs> I haven't hit one thing, not one. Uh, let's see. Uh, <laughs> uh, er. it's, it's, yeah, it's I'm telling you, there's something wrong here. It's it's having to do with that whole decimal system. With the other thing, it <laughs> screwed up the numbers. I guarantee it. Look, no. Oreo just rolls a DS now. <laughs> We're just getting oh, death saves. We're just a little like, as D and D players, just uh, a little stitches. Okay. All right. It's so trails, man. Um, it's it's them cam cam trails. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to um, fly so that I'm like kind of sitting on this zombie's like shoulder if I can, <laughs> okay. and I'm going to look at this guy. And I'm going to um, get some fairy dust in my hand, okay. and I'm going to and I'm going to do an intimidation check. Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, uh, "What? Okay, what is he? Okay, uh, what is he wearing? First off, uh, he is wearing some khakis. Uh, it's a red robe. <laughs> with khakis. Khakis. It's, a, it's a red robe. <laughs> it's Jake with, from State Farm. Um, mm-hmm. With a it's it's a hooded robe." And underneath mm-hmm. the robe uh, is uh, chainmail. Yeah, 
Okay. And some khakis. And some khakis. And some khakis. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, yeah, on the picture, it looks like there's sort of like a, um, what do you call it? Like a capulet? I, I don't know what they're called. They're like yes. a cape that goes down to yes. this. Sure. But it goes, okay. I'm going to tell them that I can use, that I'm going to sprinkle this on their capulet so that it will choke the life out of them if they don't stand down. Okay. Go for it. Intimidation. Make yeah. An intimidation check. Okay. Or not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very intimidating. <laughs> uh, I was even I was even gonna be like, oh, you can have advantage because that's that's really clever. But uh, yeah, advantage <laughs> with that. Yeah, I mean that's that's uh, that's all I can give you. Um, okay. Uh, he didn't know the word that you used. He didn't know what a capulet was, so it just didn't work. <laughs> <on him. laughs> all right, mm-hmm. that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. Uh, and that's that's my whole turn. Right? Oh, okay. Is all that right. my whole turn? Yeah, that would be yeah, that would be your whole turn. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's see. This guy's gonna do the same thing. He's got to roll a d8 and re-roll eights. Five. So that's one, two, three, four, five. All right. This one is going to go against the zombie that uh, is the Vendra p- protector. Uh, and it's advantaged. And it's fifteen. Does a fifteen hit? Does a fifteen hit? Oh no, it, it, it does because they have armor class thirteen. So <laughs> that hits, doing seven bludgeoning damage. So that puts him at six. And that's his turn. Steph. Yes. We got some things to do. Um Man, like I really keep wanting to do like clericy things and do spells on people's and like I know they have, you know, nothing. Like they're going to they're going to smite my spells down. Um Hold on, I might have something. Uh... Okay, I was thinking I was going to try to cast something on us to help, but honestly, I think it's just going to be better for us to just get rid of these guys. So I'm going to attack this one between me and uh, Scribbles here. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna smack. Oh my fuck! <sighs> I'm trying. <laughs> Oreo, make a death save. Are, are you there? Hello? Hey, Smokey. No, just the, the... <laughs> are, you, are you there, Oreo? Are you muted? Did, <coughs> Did you die? I killed him. Uh, all right. Well, I'll He's make... gone to go get some Paco's tacos. I'll make his death save for him. Uh Sure. Oh, you've been rolling With ones. I don't know. No, no, I mean, just, well, right. Well, I'm going to roll and we'll see what we'll see. As long as I don't roll a one. <laughs> a death save. Mm. <laughs> Doesn't count. Oh, my God. <laughs> we oh my could God. not have done that uh, all right. any more perfectly. I'm just gonna, we're just gonna, Oreo. Count, we're just gonna count that as a failure. I, I, I refuse to, to be anything more than that. Uh. Gosh, tough dice. Your dice just <laughs> suck balls tonight. <laughs> uh, Fisty here is gonna stay in not the corner. Not very well either. Uh, gonna stay in the corner. Vendra is gonna say uh, niceties from the background. Uh, Zanny, you're up. 
Alrighty. Right back at it. And hernia. There you oh. go. Hey. Okay, I'm back. What happened? Doing work. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. Well, you failed mm. a death save. As you know, yeah, it's you know we're what? here. No. Go ahead and roll, roll a death save. At least if he rolls bad, it's on him. Make a death save. All right. Thank we'll, God. Right, we'll let that slide. All right. <laughs> so you do 10 damage against him doing four. I'm going to go back to Oreo and make him one and O. Oh. And you might, you'll have to fix that on your, um, on your character sheet because I, I said it as a failure. Uh, Zanny hits doing 10 damage. Scribbles, that is one and one. Make a death save. Big money, no whammies. Ooh, big money. Here's a success. You are two and one. All right. Five here. He is going to. Let's see. Oreo's on death save, so we're going to make it a d6 instead. I don't it's like a it. really good thing we told that old lady to stay in that room. Yeah, it really is, isn't it? Uh, one, two. Do the skeletons still swing though? Are oh, they still they, yeah, trying they to attack that right. guy? Yeah, you're right. They're still attacking. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll go ahead and make yeah make your three. Or who are they? They're attacking. The oh. Hey. The same guy because that's the only one I told them. So you, I'm down. So yeah. I can't tell him another guy. You are correct. But but I think that guy dies. So but now that, what do they do? That, they're not going to do anything. They're just going to. They'll just stand. Uh, they're going to be proud that they did it. Um. I mean, I technically have the other skull. Would they listen to me? No. Ah, fuck. Uh, Wayne, you're up. All right. Which one is it that's closest to me? Yeah, this is the, Probably this one. Yeah, that's the only one that's left that, that is not cowering. Okay. <laughs> well, he is the physical embodiment of Cat B. <laughs> I mean, he's pretty strong, <clears throat> then. Um, I'm just going to go pee. There's really, it's no reason why that's going on. All right, so <laughs> instead of that attack, we're going we're gonna to count that as your... Um, uh, 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 what's it called? You were vicious mockery, so he's gonna make a vicious mockery save. A nine, either way. Yeah, he's he, uh, roll a d4 for damage. Are you talking to Wayne? If you're still here, or did you just up and leave? I was gonna say, I think he went to go pee. He, he went to pee real fast, yeah. All right, uh, all right, well, let's see if I can roll another one. <laughs> That too. All right. Well, we'll take that. Uh, it's middling, yeah. Yeah, that's middle of the road. Well, it, that could be worse. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Nicole. The dice gods hate us. Yeah, the dice gods yes. are just not working for us tonight. All right. So, I'm going to. Uh, how many hit points does this dude have? He's, he has two. He's at two. Okay. Yep. There ain't no sense in doing nothing fancy. All right. I'm going to fly up to him. And just like wail down on him with my great club. All right, wail away. Maybe not. <laughs> oh boy. Jesus. Uh... Maybe. <clears throat> All right, so he is going to attack back, but he loses his advantage because of vicious mockery. And we're going to roll a d6. Hey, this is going to go against the protector zombie. With his mace. Oh. 18, so he definitely hits doing 8 damage. Oh, he kills one. <gasps> what? Oh, oh he, kills the, he kills the protector zombie. Uh-oh. Uh... Not the Stand up and be counted. So the protector zombie. I would be upset, but I'm <laughs> incapacitated. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you won't know about this until afterwards. Um, let's see. Steph, you're up. Okay. Who do I got left? 
Oh. He only has two hit points. The one in the middle? Yeah, that's it. And the other one's cowering. I mean, you can hit him. I mean, I'll even say that um, uh, since he's cowering, <laughs> you know, you get auto, your um, your attacks will auto hit, but he's literally cowering in the corner. Um, am I close enough to hit him with my mace, I guess? Uh, no. Yeah, it, it, if you were to, the only one that's close enough to hit him would be Zanny. If you move, you would trigger an attack of opportunity. Ew. And then if I use my um, crossbow, it's going to be at disadvantage. That is correct. Oh. And Sacred Flame, I have advantage on shit. I'm still going to try it because I think that's going to be the safest route versus me smacking one of us. I would rather fail a fucking cantrip versus hitting one of us. All right. Casting Sacred Flame on the middle guy. All right. So you're casting the middle on the middle guy. He has to make a, a spell save of DC, but thanks to Vicious Mockery, he's at disadvantage. Oh. Uh, Mockery is yes. A deck save. 15. Mm. 10. Yeah. A 10. Roll a D8 and don't roll a 1. Shit. Hey, describe Ooh. his death. Oh, you've caused so much harm to my friends. I raise my hands up high, and as I'm doing so, I'm laughing. <laughs> just smite him right down there in the middle. There's just blood smattered everywhere. You yeet. <laughs> this bitch empty. Eat. Uh, okay. Um... Now I've got to heal people. And that blood splattered on Scribbles, she likes heart. <laughs> yes. It got right on your forehead like a like a Ash Wednesday kind of cross. <laughs> I was going to say like Rafiki did to Simba. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm religious, honey. Simba. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, um... okay. Yep. So you have a you have a you guys are out of combat now. <clears throat> um. Let's see. So we're gonna go ahead and end. We're gonna end combat. What is this? Yeah. What's he doing? Uh, he's still um... powering. So, I mean, oh, yeah, he's right. not Yeah, he's and he's not attacking. So you're just gonna end combat. Um. I gotta heal everybody. Yeah, I was gonna say some people need to be picked up and 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 that. And we should run back to our safety room and take another <laughs> long rest. Yeah. <laughs> it's not happening. Um, not and happening. find some oh. more prisoners. We were too late to see. Yeah, not um, happening. <laughs> can I um, use my medicine check to raise up Zara? Uh, sure. Oh yeah, okay. I'll come down here. First and do the same thing. Smelling salt. Smelling salt's not good. Can I use my advantage? You sure may. Please. Uh, okay. <laughs> you could certainly try. Yeah, so uh, Zara, <laughs> you, Zara, you are up with um, one hit point. There's that for um, Scribbles. Scribbles is back mm -hmm. up with one hit point. <laughs> I like how far away you sounded, too. That was perfect. <laughs> um... What happened to Jed? <laughs> Jed, did you name them? <laughs> uh, well, Jed is dead. <laughs> yeah, Jed, Jed is gone. Oh, right. Jed can't um, be dead. What do you mean? Uh, he, he got, he got, got killed. Smo by. Smitten? Smoten? How long was smitten? that gone? Uh, long enough. enough. I don't know. Um, Not even a minute, really. Yeah, no, I'm sitting here doing it uh, maybe, maybe 18 seconds. I'm gone for one. I'm gone for <laughs> 19 and a half seconds. And you guys can't even protect um, Jed. I'm gonna uh, pop yeah, this on. Jed is a zombie. Like, We're not. Jed really... protected us. He was a hero. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, he died a hero. Yeah. He, he, yeah. I'm gonna okay. pop cure wounds yeah. onto um, Smokey, but don't forget also that with that I have 
Uh, hold on. I got to find the thing. I have an extra thing. Where is the thing? Oh. Thing. That. Yeah. Uh, it does not look great. The creature creature regains additional hit points equal to two plus the spell's level. Okay. Uh, so, That's a level two spell. <clears throat> yep. So roll a d8 plus your spell casting ability modifier plus four. That's a D8. Oh, hey, fuck. Nice. Smokey's about <laughs> to have a great day. So. Um, spellcasting modifier. Oh, what is that again? Just my wisdom modifier. Uh, yeah, whatever, whatever, whatever the ability is for your for your character. It says it in there. Wisdom, charisma, spellcasting ability. Yeah. If it's but whatever. Um. It's so yeah, that's a five. So nine. Nice. Seventeen. And then. Two, four, yeah. onto that. Yeah, so 17 total. Yeah! Oh, you won't let him go over? No. Well, no, no, no. That, okay. you know, what I'm saying is that is that's total. You rolled an eight. Um, plus a five. Plus a five is 12. Or, yeah. No, okay. Wait. Yeah. It, 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 he's back up to full hit yeah. points. Whatever he's at. He's yes, 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 yes. I'm not a math guy. He's, he's 13 <laughs> plus the additional four puts him at 17. That's where it's at. But, or he's 17 or full health, whatever's lowest. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. I was just making sure all the numbers were getting added in there. I'm also a bit woozy. Um, What is uh, Zara at? Uh, one. Yeah, she's at one hit point. Uh, what can I, I don't do? have the what magic that do? makes the sparkles in the in the knitting of the heels together. And I'm trying to sound intelligent. Uh, spare the dying is not quite what I need. Um, I guess I'll do the same thing. Oh God, it's gonna put me down to one spell slot. But I would rather do it like that. So I guess I just need to roll that yep, roll D8 another, again. Yeah, yeah, roll a D8. So four and four. Nine. Five, yeah. So 10, 11, 12, 13. 13. So yeah, uh, Zara gets, Zara's up to 13. Yeah, 13, uh, 13 hit points or full health, whatever's lowest. Oh, wait. Plus, didn't Zara have one hit point already, too? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah okay, so you're at 14. Is, I think 13's my max. I can't remember, though. Um... Well, either way, you're good. Okay. Um, we are going to stop here for the night. Yeah. Uh, let everyone just have a week to decide uh, what they're going to do with their cowering fatty. <laughs> I know what I want to do. Whatever we no. want. No. <laughs> huh? I didn't no. say anything. <laughs> no checking prison pockets. Uh, no, I wasn't going to do that. You. What, what is wrong with you? I was talking to you on that one. Jesus. What is wrong? Yeah, that's just, that's just got aggressive. It's uh, you know. No, you I have to say the thing. Be aggressive, but not that aggressive. Holy cow! Sure. <laughs> uh... he... Okay, I'm putting the I'm putting the notes in the um, chat. Yeah. Awesome. So uh... Make sure you make a note about prison pockets. No. Prison pockets. <laughs> no, uh, we're not prison pockets. <laughs> all right uh all right well thanks everybody i'm gonna go ahead and hit the stop button on the stream so thank you to everybody that hung out in the stream we had quite a few people in here at one point in time Ooh. and k love you bye